Hello friends, let us see the three mislabeled jars puzzle. In this puzzle, there are three jars containing fruits and having a label on them. The first jar contains apples and is labeled as apple. The second jar contains oranges and has a label on it as oranges. Similarly, we have a third jar having both apples and oranges and is labeled as apples and oranges. But by mistake, all the three jars are mislabeled. So now you are allowed to pick only one fruit from any of the jars and examine it. So which jar would you choose so that you are able to correctly relabel all the three jars? Let me give you a hint. Consider the jar which is labeled as apple. Since we know that all the jars are mislabeled, so this jar can be that of oranges or apples and oranges only. Try the puzzle again. Let's come to the solution. Suppose let us select a jar which is labeled as apple. We also know that this label is incorrect. Now when you pick a fruit from this jar, it can be an orange or an apple. Suppose you pick an apple from it. Now analyze carefully that out of the three jars, Apples are present only in two jars, the labeled apple jar and the labeled apples and oranges jar. Now, if you get an apple from the jar which is mislabeled as apple, it clearly indicates that this jar must be that of apples and oranges. So, to understand it more clearly, let us see this diagram. When you pick an apple from this mislabeled jar, the only option left with us was the apples and oranges jar. So we changed the label of this apple jar from apple to apples and oranges. Now we are left with two other jars, the orange jar and the apple and orange labeled jar. Now, this jar which is labeled as orange, it must be changed to apple because we already labeled one of the jars as apples and oranges and we got an apple from this jar. So, the orange jar must be labeled as apple and the apple and orange jar is labeled as orange. But if you pick an orange from the jar which is mislabeled as apple, you get two possibilities. Either the correct label of the jar could be of oranges or that of apples and oranges. So selecting the jar which is mislabeled as apples may or may not always help us to find the proper label of jars. Similarly, starting with the jar which is mislabeled as oranges may not be useful. So, we should always start with the jar which is mislabeled as apples and oranges. Let us see how. When you start with the jar, which is mislabeled as apples and oranges and suppose when you pick a fruit you get an orange from it. So now you get a surety that oranges could be present in only two jars the apple and orange jar and the orange jar. Since this is incorrect label 
so the only possibility left is change this label from apple and orange to orange now the orange jar must be labeled as apple and the apple jar must be labeled as apple and orange now and if we draw a fruit which comes out to be apple from this apple and orange mislabeled jar we again have a surety that apples are present in only the apple containing jar and the apple and orange labeled jar since this would be the incorrect label so it always must be the apple jar and similarly we can correct the labels of other two jars stay tuned and keep watching